So, hey, y'all. I just wanted to come here and touch on one thing. Somebody had inboxed me on here, and he was like, well, what's the not-so-positive part about coming out and telling people that you have herpes? <laughs> he wanted to see the not-so-positive part. Depending on how you look at it, everything is about perspective. The not-so-positive part about coming out to people is that when you come out to people, you better know that they are going to tell one to two people, three, four, that person going to tell that person and that person going to tell the next person. So when that happens, you really just got to not give a fuck. Um, depending on who you are and how you carry yourself, people will enjoy. They going to enjoy. <laughs> They're going to enjoy telling your business. And... That's something that you have to just be aware of, take note of. Some people actually just enjoy telling other people business, and that's okay. Um, that's okay. It really assists you in the coming out process. If you really look at it from a different perspective, it kind of makes it easier. Like, oh, okay, well, I ain't got to tell you because I know so-and-so going to go around telling A, B, C, D, E, F, and whoever else going to fucking listen. So that's the only not-so-positive part about coming out, I guess you could say. And if it, I feel like if you hold those people at a certain standard, like if you feel like, oh, these people are so loyal or whatever, they're not going to tell nobody. Mm, you know what I'm saying? Mm, mm. So you really just have to be prepared for anything of that nature um, to happen. So and you have to be comfortable with that. And that takes a lot of healing. Um, it's like a lot of tears. And it's okay. I tell people when y'all message me like, oh, I, they be like, oh, I've been crying. I'll be like, oh, okay, that's okay. That's good. Crying is very healing, so that's good. You should cry. Um, I cried a lot of tears before I ever got to this point of speaking about having herpes. I cried a lot of tears. A lot of tears. Yep, so did. Cried a lot of tears before I ever got comfortable speaking about having herpes, okay? Do you hear me? So I try to stress that point to get people to understand that it, it won't be so easy starting now. Especially if you first just get diagnosed. Like, baby, it's okay. Take your time. You are still beautiful. You're learning how to, you're relearning how to love yourself and who you are and how to reconnect back to you. Okay, so <clears throat> that's the only negative part, I guess you could say, depending on how you look at it. But yeah.